today's video you're going to watch, it is very disturbing. And Pastor Tim uh, Ross, he blasphemed God's name, disrespecting Jesus Christ, talking about he's going to make it rain or he was a stripper. Pastor Tim Ross, you better repent. And the whole Transformation Church, y'all need to repent. Mike Todd, he needs to repent too. Every last one of you that had y'all part in it in that church, Transformation Church, y'all better repent. God will not be mocked. He's going to hold every last one of y'all accountable for even getting up saying that. And that's not good. It ain't even funny either. And people going around here clapping their hands. Y'all better repent. I'm telling you, Judge. The video you're going to watch is very disturbing and disgraceful. I pray that these people in the world will come to repentance. Because we are living in the last days and people think this is a big fat joke. No, it's not a joke at all. It's sad and I feel sorry for them who are perishing. He ain't the first one to make it rain. Literally, he's not the first one to make it rain. I could take you to Genesis to prove to you who the first person was that made it rain. But scripture said that manna came from heaven and it was bread to them. We don't make it rain on booty cheeks. We don't make it rain on strippers. We only reverence one stripper and that's the one that took off glory to put on humanity and then get butt naked on a cross to die for both you and me. The only stripper I'm in love with is Jesus. And he's the one that puts that bread in my pocket. That bread in my pocket. Galatians 6, 7 NKJV Do not be deceived. God is not mocked. For whatever a man sows, that he will also reap. Matthew chapter 7, verse 15 to 20 NKJV Beware of false prophets, who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are ravenous wolves. You will know them by their fruits. Do men gather grapes from thorn bushes or figs from thistles? Even so, every good tree bears good fruit, but a bad tree bears bad fruit. A good tree cannot bear bad fruit, nor can a bad tree bear good fruit. Every tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and thrown into the fire. Therefore by their fruits you will know them. Matthew 12, 31 to 32 NKJV. Therefore I say to you, every sin and blasphemy will be forgiven men, but the blasphemy against the Spirit will not be forgiven men. Anyone who speaks a word against the Son of Man, it will be forgiven him, but whoever speaks against the Holy Spirit, it will not be forgiven him, either in this age or in the age to come. Jude chapter 1, verse 18 NKJV. How they told you that there would be mockers in the last time who would walk according to their own ungodly lusts. 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 3 to 4 NKJV. Knowing this first, that scoffers will come in the last days, walking according to their own lusts, and saying, Where is the promise of his coming? For since the fathers fell asleep, all things continue as they were from the beginning of creation. Proverbs chapter 19, verse 29 NKJV. Judgments are prepared for scoffers, and beatings for the backs of fools. 1 Timothy chapter 4, verse 1 to 2 NKJV. Now the Spirit expressly says that in latter times some will depart from the faith, giving heed to deceiving spirits and doctrines of demons, speaking lies and hypocrisy, having their own conscience seared with a hot iron. 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 3 to 4 NKJV. For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine, but according to their own desires, because they have itching ears, they will heap up for themselves teachers, and they will turn their ears away from the truth, and be turned aside to fables.